Joined by Fernando Burgos and Eddie Riley, a pair of seniors who were huge in the Beacon 6-3 win over Rhode Island College. Fernando struggled a little bit in the first inning. They were able to get a couple of hits, and then you really settled in seven innings, just allowing the two runs. Uh, what was your focus going into this game against a Rhode Island College team that typically swings the bats pretty well? Uh, only thing I was thinking about was just keeping my team in the game, uh, making sure you know we didn't use up the bullpen. Obviously, it's a short tourney, so... Arms are pretty uh, valuable in this tournament. You got some really good defense behind you. Charlie Hugie with a phenomenal stab uh, to end one inning and a great play to end another. How big was it to have the defense behind you uh, to keep the game moving? You kept also kept your pitch count pretty low. Uh, just keeping it, you know, the nine versus one mentality, obviously. Charlie's been a good fielder for the last four years. You got Eddie behind you. You got Lopey. You got great outfielders. So just pitch the contact and they'll make the plays. Turn it over to Eddie Riley. Uh, you guys go down 1-0 early, and then you mash the baseball over the scoreboard and left. Uh, what was going through your mind in that at bat, and, and what pitch did you get that you were able to drive? Yeah, I think just seeing all his pitches, I think he uh, threw me two good curveballs pretty early that I was able to see, and then a couple fastballs in the dirt. So um, I was able to get myself to a 3-1 count and got a pitch I could hit. Yesterday, the offense kind of struggled just the two runs. Today, uh, the seniors really came through. You had a couple RBI. Lopez had a couple of RBI. Boudris had a couple of big hits. What was your mentality as a group going into this one after not hitting as well as you could have yesterday? Yeah, I think just uh, just trusting the process. I think we all, we all knew what we were facing yesterday and today as well. Um, and we were just looking to make contact and put balls and play hard. And, you know, I think we did a pretty good job of that today. And then to either one of you, Joey Rogers doesn't typically come out of the pen. His first collegiate save, uh, how big was that? Again, you talk about saving pitchers. Your bullpen outside of Bobby Tramandozzi is totally fresh. Yeah, that was huge. Um, you know, like Nando touched upon, pitching's huge in this tournament. If you can save as many arms as you can, you got to save them. And, you know, Joey came in and really did a good job closing the game up. Thanks so much for your time, guys, and congratulations on the win.